the chiropractor who saved Christmas. Twas the night before Christmas, and at the North Pole, Santa and his reindeer were preparing to go. When all of a sudden, poor Dancer stopped dancing, Dasher stopped dashing, and Prancer stopped prancing. Santa was worried, confused, and upset. Please, little elves, go and fetch me the vet. So the elves fetched the vet, and he came right away. He checked out the reindeer, and he had this to say. Oh, Santa, I wish that I knew what to do, but I'm as confused and worried as you. So they talked, and they thought, in the warm little stall. When one little elf, so sweet and small, quietly said, I know who to call. It's May, and she lives just three houses down, in the little white cottage at the edge of our town. But what can she do, inquired St. Nick, so that my poor reindeer aren't feeling so sick? May is a chiropractor. She'll adjust the spine, said the sweet little elf. Why, she's done it to mine. They're just out of alignment from all that they do. And I think, he said shyly, Santa, you need this too. Santa thought for a moment, then stated with haste, Well, call her right over. We've got no time to waste. So the elves fetched May, and she came right away. And while she greeted the reindeer, she heard Santa say, Let's get this show moving. Let's get underway. It's almost time to leave with the sleigh. The world really needs us. The children are waiting. So let's get in line for some health May's creating. Um, Santa, Maeve said, our health comes from inside. I just help with alignment so your sickness can't hide. You create your own health. You create how you feel. I help open the channels so your body can heal. We all have a gift and it is really quite neat. The world's like a puzzle that we all help complete. Yours is with presence and kindness and giving. I share an adjustment and a new zest for living. Santa smiled at May and he gave her a wink. Dr. May, Santa chuckled, I like how you think. So they all lined up quickly in a neat little row. There was excitement among them when it was their turn to go. It got quiet while May adjusted each little elf, and then the vet, and then the reindeer, and even Santa himself. They were amazed at her gift and her gentle touch. And when each one was finished, Santa said, thank you so much. May put on her coat and she folded her table. And she said this to Santa before leaving the stable. One Christmas you'll look down from your sleigh up above and you'll see that the whole world is filled up with love. And you'll wink and you'll smile when you see this come true. It's a little of me and a little of you. Santa's eyes twinkled and May's twinkled too, with each of them knowing the job they must do. With that, the reindeer were ready to go and up on the rooftop it started to snow. May said her farewells and walked home through the night and she knew for that moment in the world all was right. Thank <laughs> you.